Hello, good day everyone. Welcome to IT01. In this video, we will discuss the chapter 5. So in chapter 5, we will um, tackle about digital technology and media literacy. So we have three objectives. The first objective is to discuss the meaning of digital technology and media literacy. Second is to identify the impact of digital media to the society. And third is discover the different challenges of digital media. So, let's start in our discussion. So first, let's define what is digital media. So what is digital media? So digital media means any media that are encoded in machine readable format. So digital media can be created, viewed, distributed, modified, and preserved on digital electronic devices. Digital can be defined as any data represented with a series of digits and media refers to a method of broadcasting or communicating information. So together, digital media refers to any information that is broadcast to us through screen. This includes text, audio, video, and graphics that is transmitted over the internet for viewing on the internet. So that is the meaning of digital media. So what are the examples of digital media? So examples of digital media include software, digital images, digital video, video games, web pages, and websites social media, digital data, and databases, digital audio such as MP3, electronic documents, and electronic books or ebooks. Digital media often contrast with print media such as printed books, newspaper and magazines, and other traditional or analog media such as photographic film, audio tapes, and video tapes. So digital media has a significant the broad and complex impact on society and culture. So combined with the internet and personal computing, digital media has caused disruptive innovation in publishing, journalism, public relations, entertainment, education, commerce, and politics. So the history of digital media, codes and information by machines were first conceptualized by Charles Babbage in the early 1800s. Babbage imagined that these codes would give him instructions for his motor of difference and analytic engine. Machines that Babbage had designed to solve the problem of error calculations. So between 1822 and 1823, because of that concept, Ada Lovelace, mathematician, wrote the first instruction for calculating numbers on Babbage engines. Lovelace instructions are not believed to be the first computer program, and other Lovelace considered as the first computer programmer. It is estimated that in the year 1986, less than 1% 1 of the world's media storage capacity was digital, and in 2007, it was already 94%. The year 2002 is assumed to be the year when human, um, humankind was able to store more information in digital than an analog media, uh, media calculating numbers on Babbage and genes. So because of digital media, um, there are a lot of impacts or changes that, um, that it caused. So the first one is the impact of digital media. So there are four impacts of digital media. The first impact is the digital revolution disrupted in industry. The third one is individual as content creator. And lastly is the copyright challenges. So in the digital revolution, um, since the 1960s, computing power and storage capacity have increased exponi um, exponentially, largely as a result of MOSFET scaling, which enables MOS transistor counts to increase at a rapid pace predicted by Moore's law. Personal computers and smartphones put the ability to access, modify, store, and share digital media in the hands of billions of people. 
and many electronic devices from digital cameras to drones have the ability to create, transmit, and view digital media. Next is the disruption in industry. So because of digital media, many industries are affected. So compared with print media, the mass media and other analog technologies, digital media are easy to copy, share, and modify. This quality of digital media has led to significant changes in many industries, especially journalism, publishing, education, entertainment, and the music business. The overall effect of these changes is so far-reaching that it's difficult to quantify. For example, in movie making, the sensation from analog film cameras to digital cameras is nearly complete. The transition has economic benefit to Hollywood, making distribution easier and making it possible to earn high quality digital effects systems. At the same time, it was affected the analog speech effects, stunt and animation industries in Hollywood. It has imposed pain, um, painful costs on small movie theaters, some of which did not or will not survive the transition to digital. The effect of digital media on other media industries is similarly sweeping and complex. So the, the quality of digital media has led to significant changes in the industries. In journalism, digital media and citizen journalism have led to the loss of thousands of jobs in print media and the bankruptcy of many major newspapers. But the rise of digital journalism has also created thousands of new jobs and specializations. Ebooks and self-publishing are changing the book industry, the digital de um, textbooks, and other media-inclusive circular are exchanging primary and secondary education. So digital media has, allowed, uh, has also allowed individuals to be much more active in content creation. Anyone can access the computers and the internet and participate in social media and contribute their own writing, art, videos, photography, and commentary to the internet, as well as conduct business online. The dramatic reduction in the costs required to create and share content have led to a democratization of content creation, as well as the creation of new types of content like blogs, memes, and video essays. So user-generated content raises issues of privacy, credibility, civility and compensation for cultural, intellectual, and artistic contribution. Where digital po media pose several challenges in the current copyright and intellectual property laws. So we can um, download and we can easily get all the information we want on the internet. So legal rights are at least unclear for many common internet activities such as posting a picture that belongs to someone else to a social media account, covering a popular songs on a YouTube, or writing fan fiction. Over the last decade, the concept of fair use has been applied to many online medias. So copyright challenges have, got, um, have gotten to all parts of digital media. Even as personal content creator on YouTube, they must be careful and follow the guidelines set by the copyright and IP laws. As YouTube creators, very easily um, get demo demonetized for their content. Oftentimes, we see digital creators lose monetization in their content, get their content um, deleted to get criticized for their content. Most times, he, um, this has to do with accidentally using a copyrighted audio track or background scenes that are copyrighted by other company. So media, let's define what is media first. So media is a Latin word, a come from the Latin word medius, meaning middle or between two things. Media literacy is defined by the trend think tank on media literacy as the ability to decode, analyze, and evaluate and produce communication in variety of forms. So how can we say that um, um, one person or individual is media literate. First is has the ability to assess 
the credibility of information received as well as the credibility of the information source. Second, has the ability to recognize metaphor and uses of symbols in entertainment, advertising, and political commentary. Third, has the ability to discern between appeals to emotion and logic and recognizes co um, covert and overt appeals. Fourth, is sensitive to verbal as well as visual arguments. Fifth, is has the ability to use critical faculties to assess the truth of information gleaned from various sources. So what um, the empowerment approach was advocated by Johnson in digital literacy, rethinking education and training in a digital world. Uh, media literacy is essential for citizenship. Second is the media are powerful social and cultural forces. Third, the media are social constructions. And lastly, audiences are active creators of their own meaning. So I hope you understand well, class. See you next meeting and thank you for listening. For more ICCT Colleges video updates, please subscribe and click the notification button.